G'day, welcome to Todd's Kitchen. Today, boy, do I have a treat for you. If you love hamburgers, I guarantee you're gonna love this one. So join me today as I make my version of a Hawaiian hamburger. Okay, so we're gonna start off with one fresh avocado. So I'm just gonna start by just cutting the avocado. Just gonna remove the seed. So grabbing our quarter, we're just going to just make some thin slices. Should get about four out of give or take. Now for this I'm going to use some pre-made hamburger buns that I've just picked up from the shops. So I'm just going to grab, grab it and just cut them in half. Now it's completely up to you how you want to do these. You can have them as is, as in not cooked. Or you can put them under the griller or broiler for America where you just do one side or stick them in the toaster if you want to do both sides. Okay, so next we're going to use some minced meat. Now I don't want to season this too much because we don't want to take the taste away from the toppings that we're going to put in this hamburger. But what I am going to add is just a little bit of mixed herbs. About a teaspoon worth. And making sure you have clean hands, just going to mix that through. Okay, so once it's mixed through, we're going to divide the mixture into two and then we're going to divide it again. So we get four hamburgers out of this recipe. Okay, so I've got a fry pan on the stove. Now this is on a medium to high heat, so we're just going to put some cooking spray oil on it. Then we're just going to add our patties. And we're just going to just slowly push them down to the desired thickness. So it's going to cook these for, this should take about 5 minutes, give or take. It depends on how thick that you like them. Personally, the thicker they are, the better they are. But some people also like them thin as well. So we're going to cook them for a few minutes on this side, then we're going to flip them over and cook them on the other side. Okay, so once your patties are cooked just how you like it, we're just going to season them just with some salt and some pepper. I'm just going to take these off and place them onto a plate. And then we're going to put in our onion rings. Now we're just going to stir fry these just until the onion rings have softened up a little bit. Okay, so onto the base of the bun, we're just going to place on a slice of cheese, then our meat patty, then a slice of pineapple, then some of our avocado, then a couple of leaves of lettuce and some onion rings then just top it off with a sauce of your choice personally I'm just going to use some barbecue okay and that's my version of a Hawaiian hamburger now it probably took about 10 minutes to make but the most important thing is what's it taste like let's find out hmm Oh, that is really good. <laughs> that is a lovely, lovely hamburger. With a mixture of those herbs, the avocado and the pineapple, this Hawaiian burger tastes simply delish. It is definitely, definitely a fabulous hamburger to make and eat. Trust me, it really tastes fantastic. Please do me a favor, leave, leave me a comment. Let me know what type of hamburgers you like, as I am interested what type of hamburgers people have around the world, because there are literally thousands of recipes for them. And as always, thanks for watching this episode of Todd's Kitchen. A list of ingredients are down below, as well as links to my Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus pages. Please do me a huge favor by giving this video a thumbs up and leave a comment, and I'll see you next time for another delicious recipe.